Hello everybody and welcome once again to Pneumatograph for Pressurize and Minecraft 115. Today we're going to start off and do some more mystical agriculture. <laughs> so let's get started. So today we're going to do some entity seeds. Actually I haven't got enough uh, prudentium essence in here, I need four. Entity seeds are all the same, so I'm probably not going to cover all of the rest of the seeds. The one I will do as well, I will do some diamond seeds. And for that we need some... where's it gone to? I need some more essences. In fact, I've got to got lots of them in here, haven't I? So we need two more of these, and we need some uh, supreme essence for the di for the diamonds. But I'm going to take all of this because I would also like to make the master infusion crystal. Because the master infusion crystal basically doesn't allows things not to, it never breaks. You can lose it, but it never breaks. So well, let's start with the, these two seeds. So we're going to do the, the diamond seed. I actually have been to um, a village and I've got um, some emeralds. So maybe we can do that at the same time here. So diamonds is right, so I'm in place thinking about something else. Did I manage to pick up? I did pick up a sterling crystal, but I forgot to do the other one. Ha ha. Right. So this one is slightly different, but they're all the same once you've got your entity seed. So you need four of these jars. Doesn't matter which ones. Today we're doing chickens. So. In the middle we put the sterium one. This is the, the and then on of course we do the same thing in all of these that we have. But of course these don't stack, so they're a bit more um awkward to set out, I suppose. So that's the right word. We need four of these, so let's do that one. And let's put the four in the ordinal direction. But everything is identical in the sense of how to produce seeds in um uh, mystical agriculture. What have I not got right here? Didn't I do that right? Let me double check it actually. I haven't thought about that. Let's have a look at Miss Chicken Seed. Chicken Seeds, tier 2. Yeah, that looks right. Sodium Seed, base, 4 jars. Did I press the button? Oh! <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> well, that's a bit daft. Oh, yeah, I had actually a pressure plate when I was doing the other, the other one. Like that. So the next one we're going to do is the Diamond Seed. We'll do that as we'll set it up and I'll have to go and get the base. We can do that another time. Because these are much easier to press to get into place because they do stack. So this time we need Supreme Essence. So that's basically each one of these requires four stacks. So four of those is 16. So we need 16 stacks to make one of Inferior Essence to make one Diamond Seed. Right, I'll be back in a second. So I've got the um, seed base. We'll simply put that down in here like that and press the button and there we go we got our diamond seed now we'll have it a few seconds when it's finished so this will give us basically inf an infinite number of diamonds so maybe i will put on some uh, supremum soil down here but before i do that let's double just check it because i want to make the master infusion crystal so the master infusion crystal Is this one so it's a supreme so we do need six so this is basically a supremium gemstone or s gemstone so we do need six of these and the prosperity gems now that's dead easy we'll go into that so what we need for this is all crafting anyway so it's not so we need a diamond and we need four prosperity shards which I went and did get some more so we, as you can see I've got some more and then we need two supremium so we'll put that down like this and it's the same stuff uh, it's very consistent as um, uh, mystical agriculture with the exception of um, the only exception is um, acceler growth accelerators they don't actually like everything else you can use the previous level to go up and the growth accelerators are the one you can't so let's make this one now we should be able to make this Oh, I forgot some more. I need to get some more shards out of here. And then we should be able to make it up. Uses. Actually, I can press the uses. In fact, you can see what you can do with this. There's actually three pages, mostly to do with the... Um, uh, so this one's unlimited uses. So it never breaks, which is great. The existing crystal I've got at the moment is this one. 
and that as you can see he's only got 59 of a thousand uses left it starts at, it says 999 but it's really a thousand uses it doesn't include the first one one thing we can do with the master infusion crystal is take inferior blocks and use those instead of uh, inferior essences so you can use this like this and make one of those and that should make prudentium blocks which is a lot quicker and a lot easier let's do that again that will give us four titanium blocks and there's one more level of this and we should get some an imperium block and now we can of course the turn this back into pretend this one and then we can go over here and what have I got over here actually I think I've got some plenty of stuff over here let's have a look I've got three so we've actually got 12 that's actually enough to make three supremium um, essence but I think I'll just try the diamond essence on this one to start with because it is expensive if I mess it up so look, this one isn't too bad this is just one stack of um, I think once like I think I'll just find a place to do it we'll do it down here and I'll make some more crop supports you'll notice I've got quite a few crop supports already done um, where is it now I don't really need too many chickens so I probably won't put chickens on this whereas I'm looking for a hoe there we go so it doesn't matter where I put this I think it's got to be four blocks away so that's one two three four yes yeah, so there'll be no problem here so let's put this down let's put the um, an imperium essence down here like that and then let's put the seed into place the diamond seed and that should reasonably quickly grow up so while that's growing let's put the other one down here um, I'm just gonna harvest this block here as you can see that's been hydrated now so let's put the chicken seed down here and that will also hydrate because that's still within four blocks of this one it's a square so that's what I think I want to do with uh oh we've got something that's come around here and I've got to get rid of him because he's a he's going to be a nuisance where is he let's turn on the mini map again over there oh he's behind us if he comes onto the crops he's a he'll break the crops let's have a look at him what's he got to offer man and see it's nothing really so goodbye I'm going to say goodbye We'll get rid of these guys. Right, just like that. Get a couple of leads and a bit, like a couple of pieces of leather. A bit brutal, but there we are. They're going to tread on my crops, and I don't want them to. We don't need anything they have anyway. To be, let's be honest about it. It's all rubbish. So let's get rid of those two out of there. What else did I pick up? Put some leather as well. That's actually handy because books, etc. Bookshelves and enchanting. Let's have a look at this guard drone next. Oh no, there's one more thing I want to make. I want to make a nature's compass. And the nature's compass is very, very easy and very, quite handy. So I want to make it. One thing I do need to make is some. Uh, I need some cactus. So let's have a look at nature's compass this thing so it's just four saplings four pieces of wood or is it logs four logs and one compass so that's just four iron one redstone four logs I've got plenty of logs let's take the oak logs here and four saplings we've got plenty of saplings in here let's take some out of and run one I swap those two chests over because I was always doing that so saplings let's look oh we've got plenty of oak saplings let's use these ones so let's make up the compass first of all again it's the same pattern for the cross isn't it with one in the middle and then it was a cross in here and then it was the saplings in the corners I think of the corners if not I'll do it again and just and these ones can go across like that and then we get a nature's compass so what we do with the nature's compass is you right click it and then you've got all of the all of the different biomes available so what I would like to find is for example desert or desert hills so you click it like that and then you, you say search so there's actually quite a long way away 2,000 blocks and this thing points to in the direction of the of where it's going to be 
over there, which is north west by the looks of it. And it's quite a, it's a two thousand block way so, so what we might do before we do that is I'm not sure. And maybe I'll just do it in my own time and go and get it. Uh, but it's what it that's what it's for. There's also got desert hills as well, and I guess that they're going to be the same. Let's have a quick look at that. Make sure that that one isn't the case. Um, there is a search in here. Oh yeah, that's, that's actually new. I haven't seen this before. So you've got desert lakes, desert hills, and desert. Well, let's have a look at desert hills. Click the info on that one. Okay, so it tells you that there, this info about desert hills. Let's go back. Here's the back button. And then let's do a oh, it's, I've lost it. No, I haven't. Let's just search. Let's click that and start search. So that was also the same is it the same direction. If you're looking at the compass, it's pointing that way. So again that's north east. And it's slightly further away. And the last one of these, let's have a look at the last one of those. Well again we'll search for desert. This is a much more friendly interface. Desert Lakes. Let's um, start the search for that one. <laughs> That's a lot further away too. <laughs> right, okay. So I shall make my way over to the Desert Hills at some stage and get some uh, cactus. The reason I want cactus, let's have a look at cactus in here. It's for cactus green. So look at the uses of that and you get this. Oh, in fact, exactly what one. It's got multiple uses. You can make cactus green as well. And the uses for this one is dye essence, I think. Oh, you can make records. You can make lime. And lime is actually one of the uses for dye essence. Just useful things in order to have for yourself, for the dye essence. You make all the colours of the dye with this one, then you get this one, you make dye essence. The uses of that basically give you four pages of four, six. 16 colors so you get all the colors from there handy saves a lot of messing around so that's what i'm using mystical agriculture for anyway so they just saved me effort it's a bit of effort at the beginning to get everything but after that it's dead easy so right i said i did a bit of village trading so i've actually got four emeralds some eight emeralds i think they're in one of these chests there we go and the use of these we can make a seed of course um where is it here so we can make an emerald see but again we need supremium essence now we are getting plenty of i'm really getting a lot of supremium while we're doing this actually i'm going to come over here anyway because i want to have a look at the drone the guard drone let's have a look at it in here as you can see it's, this one's already it's got it's got basically Two stacks, one stack and 42, so now I cleared it all out, so it needs a little bit more time for that to go. And this one is hissing away because it's no real reason really, it's just got a little bit of extra power. It's off, so that that's fine. Let's have a look at this. Let's put the drone into here. And let's have a look at the upgrades for the drone. So it's got an on-off upgrade and a item life upgrade. Very important, especially for guard drones. Um, we can put a range upgrade to increase its range. That's what we've done. So those are all those three here. We've got a, a volume upgrade, which will increase the amount of air it can take. And what that will basically means, it'll run for longer. Um, speed upgrade, that will make it do its business faster. And a security upgrade allows it to go into water. Now, the more of these you have, let's have a look. It tell me about this. Yes, it does. So. With one security upgrade, the drone can operate within fluids. We've seen this already. There's two upgrades, the fluids around the drone will be temporarily displaced away. And with three or more upgrades, the fluids will be permanently removed. So the drone will never be willing the drone will never willingly enter lava. What does it say then? Regardless of security upgrades. So one or more security upgrades will provide drone protection from electrical damage. Ah oh, yes, this is to do with uh, immersive engineering. I've not got that installed, so we don't need to worry about that in this case. It's night time, and there's a, there's a security, and I actually had to make another one. I couldn't find this before. I thought it had died. It hadn't died. It was just not feeling too well. <laughs> That's the right word. So what we're going to do is we're going to set this one up over the other side anyway. 
but we're going to make the mini upgrade the minigun upgrade now the minigun you can use like a ranged weapon anyway so let's have a look at building the minigun well it's night time so it's a good thing to do so the minigun has got it also takes ammunition so here we have a minigun recipe so we're going to make one of these up so we need an air canister chest gold a lever a uh, compressed ironing and a cannon barrel i think i've already made this stuff up but anyway we'll do it this way so we need one pressure tube i've taken all the stuff out and i've put it over the other side uh, i'll come back in a second i wait i shall come have a quick sleep and come back in a second i should have got all the bits so let's let's quickly make one of these up i want to make two so maybe we'll just make a second one of these so let's do that again so the recipe for this was one of these so we need these reinforced brick walls which we haven't got any of but we've got plenty of this stuff so we need two sets of this i think because that was eight each time so we'll just make another set of those and then we'll do the we'll do that again so we need the cannon barrel we need the walls and we can, should be able to make six which is what we need to make the um <clears throat> so it was down the side if i remember rightly uh, to make the cannon barrel so, and i think this is at the bottom like this so we've got the cannon barrel chest no problem gold ingot and lever and an air canister now air canister requires redstone let's get that out hello so <laughs> say hello to my little friend very good so we need <laughs> that was redstone wasn't it i've got anything here i can get rid of i've got planks let's try that again air canister we want don't we let's get one of these We've got levers. We just need a bar, uh, some gold. I put I put <laughs> put this down here. We needed gold and I think a chest. I can probably do a chest. Let's have a look. Eight. I've got four. I need another one of those. Let me just put oh, a bit. Inventory's a weeny bit on the full side. I'll tell you what. Let's put this bow away. I don't need two bows. Um, where's a good place to put it? Here, I think. Let's put this bow away. And then I've got enough space to do what I want to do it. Ah, oh, yes, I know what I need that for. Anyway, chest. We should be able to make a chest up. No, we haven't got enough stuff. We need to first of all convert this to two. Do it like this. And put the wood back again. Which was probably a mistake because I've got these in here, never mind. So I think, what do we missing from that? Nothing. We've got everything we need. So we've got two mini guns. They don't stack. Oh, they do stack. Good. And then we got ammunition. So basically, the easy one is the mini gun ammunition. This one here. So that needs gold, compressed iron, and gunpowder. Then you can enchant it with different potions. It says, it says it potion of invisibility i'm not quite sure what the use of that one is but maybe a fire potion would be pretty good so this is no regular minigun ammo it has special properties it can be crafted into a potion to gain the potions effect so you'd probably like put something like wither on it if you can and then it'd give you wither the mobs you're attacking with wither and these ones here are upgrades to this one so you've got an incendiary one which basically shoots sets things on fire what do we need for that let's try, try that again <laughs> This is two blaze rods and a minigun ammo. So these are upgrades to this. Weighted minigun ammo that's obsidian in a block of gold. That'll give it, what's it tell us about this one? Specialized minigun, more damage than normal. But due to its larger mass, it's very short range. It only uses air from the minigun at the faster rate. Right, okay. The next thing we do with one of these, let's have a look at this. We need this, the minigun upgrade. And I should have everything I need for that if I take these out of my trash can. So let's get that also made up. So we've got this mini gun upgrade. We'll go and demonstrate that in a minute because it's going to bound to be coming up towards the night time fairly soon. Whatever I do, it's always night time. So now we can put this into this. Where's it gone to? Oh, I've got a dog. When I was going through, I was looking for some deserts. I didn't build the, I did it the wrong place. Deliberately didn't build, what have we got in here? Five bar, good. Um, let's put that in there and have a look at this one. Put this into its place here like this. Uh, have I not got any, 
Oh, that's the minigun. Oh, it's the minigun, so it can have some ranges as well. So it can have a dispenser upgrade. Increases the, uh, the effects. Okay. So it depends on the rate of ammunition used. An entry tracker zooms the player when the minigun is activated. The player view, no extra cost. Okay. Maybe we can do one of those. Range upgrade is obviously going to increase its range. It's up against five meters. That's pretty good, actually. The, so the base range of 50 meters. Okay, so it uses more air when that happens. Light ammo, great, replenished ammo when the magazine's empty. That's very good. I like that one. Um, but it uses very steep air cost. Okay, that's not so great. And then speed upgrades. So we can allow three speed upgrades. So that'll shoot faster. And security upgrades prevents mini ammo from damaging tamed entities or other players at no extra air cost. That's pretty good. So we can do some of these. Well, I'll prepare those for next time anyway. So we can actually use this. Well, we first of all, we need some ammo, don't we? So I haven't done the ammo yet. What I was going to do is to put this into this drone here. So we can just click that in here like that. And then we've got a drone with, it's actually got some more air in here than the other one. So it's going up like that. So we can put this down, but we have to make some minigun ammo for this one. So let's do that at the same time. What do we need? We're bound to need gunpowder. Now gunpowder is obviously a resource that's it's going to be hard to get without grinding. I need just basically a recipe for this one. Let's look at the recipes for this one. We can use creeper essence. So three creeper essences. I've already found some in dungeon tests and obviously been killing a few creepers to get some more. And so we need a creeper suit. Now that's these ones we need to kill a lot of creepers with that dagger it's not going to be easy so i will need to find a good way of having that doing that maybe you have to build a mob spawner for that if i do build a mob spawner i'll do that in my own time we'll have a look at it later on so what do we need to do so we've got this this and oh, we need to make some mini gum ammo so what do we need gunpowder compressed iron and gold now gold is no longer in a shortage supply as you can see stacks and stacks of essence any one of these will give us um 16 gold but i've already got tons look at this so let's make four of these because i've got four compressed iron in here well i'm gonna have to make some more compressed iron i'll take a stack with us anyway so four of those plus how many, how many yes i've got four so let's make these now make that they don't stack, shame. We also need another chest, because we need to put them down on something. So we just need one piece of oak, like that. I'm having a look at difficulty seeing it. Where's the oak gone to? Ah, here we are. And then we can make a, another chest. What in fact we'd like to do is also make a new Matticraft chest, because those are handy. And I haven't done that yet. But first of all, we're going to put this down. Oops, that doesn't help having that in my hand, does it? So let's go and put this down somewhere that's sensible for us. It's got a good range, it's 32 blocks. So somewhere like here would be fine. Let's put it down here. So we put the minigun ammo into it, in here like that. And then you can put the drone down. Now this is not the same as the minigun ammo on our own thing. So we'll put the drone down on the chest, shift right click it like that and it has got a standby upgrading which is great but now you see it's got the minigun attachment and it should have taken one of the ammos out of here with our own minigun let's have a look at this you can shift right click it and then you can put into this minigun ammo like that and it should tell us so we can upgrade this gun at the same time um i don't think Oh, it's supposed to got this one's got air in it. I'm not sure whether the other one's got air in it. See, it's got a thousand of a thousand. Um, it's coming up to night time, so maybe it's a good time to go and shoot something. Let's go and find something. And I'll be back in a second when I've found something. Right, just to be on the safe side, before I start this, I'm going to move this over to here, like that. 
because I can see it already I can already see over here a creeper I think there's a sort of creeper just over here something yeah there's something over here definitely yeah there look you can see his feet let's shoot him do you see the delay we're gonna miss him 190 don't think I'm doing very well actually let's, let's come back over here this is where the speed upgrades help huh difficult to see them with these trees as it happens let's go somewhere else where it's a bit easier compare this to the, the time of a bow it's quite long some mobs over here coming towards me yes I can see some let's try this on these ones zombies it uses a lot of ammo it uses quite a lot of ammo <laughs> compare that to my bow and it doesn't really make sense to you to use it at the beginning until you've actually got the other stuff in here <laughs> there's the creeper over here. let's just go and get him as well as compared to one hit shot I'll try again see this one will work on this creeper over here a lot of creepers no doubt about it it's got a good range though there he is not making any noise is it working it seems to be working But just to be on the safe side, we'll take the bow. He's still there. Ooh, lots of creepers. Look at all those. <laughs> I'm running out of the way as quickly as I can. This would be a good time to have that... Uh, to get that essence in order to get gunpowder. I've got a reason why I got gunpowder from that little exercise. <laughs> They were hissing as well, I could hear them hissing. Uh, normally I get blown up, let's be honest about it. So that's the minigun. But obviously it's better for the drones to have the minigun. There's no one up there, look. What's he doing right up there? Yeah, the see the yeah. The drone targeted him anyway. I could have left it and he would have done it he would have done his job. But of course it doesn't pick up the drops so they basically just disappear so but we handy for gunpowder how many we pick up five so that's more than the ammo you've used so that's not too bad oh i wanted to make some compressed iron didn't i i forgot to do that and um, shift those into that six stacks and obviously to do this tank remember i wanted to put the dispenser upgrade into this and the dispenser upgrade is actually here Let's take this out of here. That fourth piece of rotting flesh too. Uh, there's a cleric in the village so I can turn those into emeralds if I want to. It's a bit tricky, I have to basically break this block. We have to go... Oh, that was the door, there's a creeper over there. I actually get quite a lot of lag around at the moment. I'm not sure if that's caused by what it's caused by as it happens so let's go down here like this then I have to break the refinery like this pick it up again of course I've got spaces I've got space in my inventory I can't pick it up for some reason or other and then I have to shift right click this so we put the dispenser upgrade into this like that then we have to shift right click this side and that should be the side it drops down at so where's <laughs> I did pick it up good. So let's put this down here like that. And then this should fill up with oil when this tank has got oil in it. So let's go and get some more oil. I think I've still got, oops, hello zombie. Let's see if the drone does his job properly this time. He's got a chicken. Yeah, not bad, it's fairly effective. I think it's slightly more effective than having the jumping into the water. And here we've got a carrot. I need a potato, that's one thing I do need. So if one of those uh it's off again, let's have a look. If any of these guys drop a carrot. What's he shooting at? Spiders. 
That's interesting. Why is it going that way? That's weird. It's running away. Oh, probably needs some more air. So you need more air. Oh, <laughs> yes, he does. Look, he's going to charge himself up on me. He's going to charge himself up on here, as you can see. That's the one with the minigun. So he'll go back again when he's charged up. That's a good demonstration of that working anyway. But something's been here because I've lost a block. I wonder what's been here. Never mind. I'll have to repair it. I can't even remember what was here. I think it's wood seeds or something like that. I think that's yes, wood seeds. So I'll probably find another wood seed in my chest. Anyway, it's time for a quick sleep. I'll be back in a second. That was interesting. I just saw the drone teleport. I'm not quite sure where it, it was pointing into this hill somewhere. And it's obviously over here now. I've seen him over here somewhere. Yeah, that's the one with the minigun. Hard to see, to be honest with you. Let's give him a push. I think that's the one with the minigun. So we really need to put some security upgrades in there anyway. So I'll be doing those off camera because we've done those before. Um, next thing I think I'd like to do is to make some plastic. We've got everything we need now. Um, or maybe logistics drones because we've, we've got plastic and LPG and stuff in here. Let's have a look. So we've got this is full of gasoline, full of kerosene, and it's got two thirds full of gasoline, uh, diesel, and LPG. It's got some more oil in, so it's stopped. And because it's stopped, this signal is now is actually is actually zero which turns this on. With this on, then this turns off. So it's not wasting any air. Fantastic. Didn't know it worked that way. It works better than I thought it was going to do. Which is great. The next thing we're going to be doing is I'm going to be doing some more. I want some cow seeds to get leather. So I'll be, I'll be working on those in my own time, as it were. As you see, I've got a pet. Uh, that was from a little bit of exploration. I was trying to find a, a jungle without using the compass, a, a desert without using the compass. I don't need to go to the jungle very much because I've got the tree essence. With tree essence, you can do that anyway. Let's have a look what I've got. I mean, I'll probably have to just quickly clear out my inventory. I don't need any more chicken eggs because the recipe for those is three for chicken essences. The uses of these, is we can make eggs, we can make feathers, we can make chickens. Um, which is all you get, isn't it? So I never need to make any more eggs, which is great. And feathers are what I want to have for, for arrows. So we don't need feathers, especially if you're then mending bow. Flint we can make and wood we can make. So we've got all of those essences for that. So that's no big deal. But plastic, let's have a look at plastic. No, we'll do those next time. First of all, we're going to finish off one more thing. Want to actually. Oh look, chicken essence, the <laughs> chicken, <laughs> chicken seed. That'll get. Let's just harvest this up now, because because I want to, because I want to put down here some essence. And I also would like to put down some crop supports. Let's put the crop supports down on the diamond seed here, and here as well. And then we can put the, on this. We'll give it some presentium, make it into presentium farmland. And then we can put the chicken seed back again. Again, where's it gone to? I've got the essence here, and I think it got picked up by the drone. Indeed it did. Let's take this chicken essence and put the seed down. Of course we have to put it down just here. Now with the crop sticks, things just tick away in the background. So we don't have to worry about watering it. But it did upgrade the watering can to an Imperium watering can, which is great. It just now gives me what? Let's have a look at the range of this. Nine by nine. So basically that'll do one. Let's go across from here. One, two, three four five I can stand here and it'll do quite a long way I think it'll do up to the iron seeds in there and there's our first diamond essence as you can see here I've also got obsidian seeds wood seeds and I really do need to replant that one I'll do that as well let's just do that we've got some no, more presenting essence here And let's get in the other wood seed or whatever seed I want to put in there. I won't do that for now because we've basically covered everything. Let's just go over here now. So between episodes, I'm going to get some more upgrades ready for the next 
for the drones, for the guard drones. Um, I might do some more work with the seeds. I'm not 100% sure yet, but I'll do that in my own time. As you can see, that the these are just basically busy. I've also got to make sure that the wood is working quite well, so I've got plenty of charcoal for the stuff. But now we've got diesel, we can make a fluid generator or a liquid generator compressor. So until next time, I wish you all the best. Bye for now. Thank you.